Hi, I'm Sibam Tongana from Sibis Table on Food Network Channel 175. I'm currently hanging out with the DSTV.com group. Sibis Bank, and it's going to be va va vu. Fast and fabulous. Blossom. Beautiful. Sibalicious. Amazing. What you can expect from the third season of Sibis Table on Food Network would be first my baby girl Mushe, I have a girl. <laughs> Two boys and a girl. I'm a very happy mom. And another thing is I've drawn a lot of inspiration with what's happening in the world. Did a lot of trend forecasting food wise. Took a few trends that are happening and then gave it a local spin. For instance, Wagyu beef is such a big thing, not only in the country, but globally as well. So I've been telling Siba about this Wagyu beef I had when I was in Australia. So I'm here to pick some up at this great butcher's. Check it out. I've got my chakalaka. It's a classic South African relish, and I'm going to turn it into a sauce for my steak. There, and I've got some fresh watercress, a nice pile right on top. Ta-da! It's beautiful. <laughs> Come, let's dig in. Mm -hmm. mm. When I create my show specifically for the recipes and specifically for season three, I took, for instance, black ink squid pasta. Uh, now that is a new thing. It's a new thing started in Australia and it just hit the, the world by storm and even got itself in the tip of Africa. Um, it's, it's one of those big trends that, that, that is happening currently in the world. So I took that, um, I'm literally probably going to be one of the first people um, to introduce it to home cooks. Ordinary people cooking at home. Um, I think what's lovely um, about Siva's Table and about this show, specifically third season, is that people are going to be a lot more experimental. I mean, we've been, I've been with the audiences for four years now, uh, so I've taught them how to cook. Now we need to take it to the next level. <laughs> Please watch my show, Siva's Table, which is coming very soon. Mwah.